Warning, this article contains potential spoilers for the woman in white on BC latest version of the Victorian novel. The woman in white started on BBC One last week. The psychological thriller has been adapted into a five-part series for the BBC with episode 2 set to air on Sunday night, April 30th, at 9 p.m. Leading the cast are Jesse Buckley as Marion Holcomb and Ben Hardy as Walter Hartwright. The woman in white herself is played by Olivia Fienal in Game of Thrones' Charles Dance is also in the cast. How to watch The Woman in White online What is the plot of The Woman in White? The Woman in White is Based on the classic 1859 novel of the same name by Wilkie Collins and is widely considered to be one of the first ever psychological thrillers and a pioneer of the sensation novel genre. The plot follows young artist Walter Hartwright who one night comes across a ghostly woman dressed white lost in London. After this encounter, he is hired as a drawing master by Frederick Fairley, played by Charles Dance, to teach his niece Laura, Olivia Vinal, and her devoted half-sister. Marion. Walter moves to Limeridge House in Cumbria where he and Laura, who bears a striking resemblance to the ghostly woman, start to fall in love but Laura is engaged to the abusive Sir Percival Glyde, Du Grey Scott, while in Limeridge. Walter realizes that the mysterious woman in white he saw is connected to the family. The woman in white 2018 cast they tell him she is a mentally disabled child named Anne Catherick, also Olivia Vinal, who lives in a mental asylum. In the book, Laura receives an anonymous letter warning her against marrying Glyde, but it goes ahead anyway. Glyde is intent on getting access to Laurie's family's huge fortune. Glyde believes the letter was sent by Anne and Laura Winters. If Glyde placed Anne in the mental asylum due to a secret she knows about him. Anne now terminally ill travels to Blackwater where Laura and Glyde are living and tells her she knows a secret about Glyde that will ruin his life. Where is the woman in Y2018 filmed? When Glyde hears that they have been communicating, he becomes Extremely paranoid and comes up with a plan to switch Laura and Anne, placing Laura in the mental asylum and burying Anne. Under Laura's name. The official synopsis from the BBC is after Walter Hartwright encounters a ghostly woman dressed in all white on a moonlit road. He soon finds himself drawn into a mysterious and disturbing world. Romance, suspense, and danger combine as secrets come to the fore in Wilkie Collins' haunting tale of insanity and identity. The story serves as a metaphor for men's control and abuse of women. Producer Sarah Curtis explains, Wilkie Collins' rage about the injustices faced by women in Victorian Britain finds expression in a story that explores the dispossession of women through marriage and the compromises that are forced upon them. In a strangely contemporary twist, the story also explores the issue of identity, where it resides and what happens when it is misappropriated. Executive produced David M. Thompson says the plot focuses on men's abuse of control over women and their ruthless determination to use women for their own ends. The story delves quite deep into the world of evil control and exploitation but above all, it's a really powerful mystery thriller. Full of twists and turns, he added. The next episode will feature Laura's ill-fated wedding to Glide. According to BBC, Laura is forced to set aside her love for Walter and marry Sir Percival, whose character takes a dark turn. Marion finds herself drawn to his enigmatic friend, Count Fosco, Ricardo Scamarchu. The Woman in White airs on Sunday night. <laughs>